everyone, it's Tammy, and I have a package here from, doesn't say who it's from, but I think it's from Love Knitting. I hope it's from them, because I ordered some yarn, and I am excited. This is it. Oh, okay, so, I think I have found a favorite yarn. I love knitting with the Malabrigio, I think is how you say it. It is this yarn. Um, Malabrigo. So I ordered a few more skeins of this. The first time I'd gotten it was in Nashville, Indiana, and I just love it. Oh, it's so soft and smushy. This is the Rios. They have other others. But I like the Rios, at least that's the only one I've used so far, but I really love knitting with it. I love the feel of it. It slides on and off the needle so well, and I have some plans for these. So this one is called Ivy, and it's a beautiful green color. Let me turn on my light here. I thought that maybe the natural light would be enough, but yeah, I think that's better. Picks up the nice yellow, and then some darker greens. It is just gorgeous, and I actually have my Swift out here so I can put these together soon. This one is interesting. What's this one called? N Nibla? Oh, I don't know. I'll just show you. And it is um, like pink or pink. No, like purple and green. Like a really light green and a little bit of like khaki or tan. It's a very neutral color. Very pretty. And then I have this beautiful pink color. This is called English Rose. And I love their tonals because there's just lots of different nice colors in there. I think that that shows a good variety. <clears throat> oh my goodness, this one is gorgeous. This one is called Magenta. And that is beautiful. And I got lots of different colors because I wanted to see what they would look like. This one is called Pearl 10. I actually have something in mind for that. And this one is Papyrus. I guess I can show you. And it's like a really dark grape and wine kind of mixture. Very pretty. And then, ooh, this one's beautiful, as Azuelas. And it's a beautiful blue with all these different shades of blue. It's just gorgeous. So there's those. And then I also got these two. These are just paint box, which I love, in Baby DK. And they are, I wondered if it tells me the color. It just says 746, but it's, I think it was heathered lavender or something like that. It was, you know, a nice light purple, maybe a heathered plum. I'm not sure. It's not really a plum though. It's more of a purple, but um, I'm going to do a little, I'm hoping to do a little baby sweater for one of my employees at work. She had a daughter um, in July, so I thought it would be neat to do a little sweater for her for Christmas. So I think that's what that's for. Her favorite color is purple. My employee, not the girl. I don't think the baby has a favorite color yet. But here are some of the things I'm hoping to make with this yarn. I wanna make this pair of mittens, so I don't know what color yet I'm gonna do those in, but there's that. Um, what else did I have picked out for that? I have some other things picked out, but not for this yarn. This picked out. This cute hat. I have this picked out. And I think that's it. So this one, I know that I picked out this color for it. And then I was going to use two other colors. So I don't know what I could use. Those three, that would be pretty. Or, I don't know.
don't know yet, but I know that this one was one of the ones I wanted to do, but I just love this yarn so much I wanted to get some. So here is my little stash. I have everything accounted for um, except for these of my Rios already. So let's see, I do need three for these. So I don't know. I wish you guys were here to help me pick out three that I could use for this. But um, by the time you've, I've talked to you, I've probably already picked out the colors. Those are kind of pretty together. I don't know. I'm going to play with it. I might even ask my husband. He's pretty good at picking out some colors. But I just wanted to show you my little haul. So thanks so much, guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.